Merry Christmas everyone and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how you can get the cob belt onto any of your outfits in GT5 Online after the new patch of 1.68 and the new Chop Shop DLC and this is after the snow as well so I'm going to show you uh, how you can put the cob belt onto any of your outfits and by the way before we get into the video make sure you do drop a like on it dropping a like is free and I highly appreciate it last video did insane it got like I think like 400 likes in a day which is absolutely insane i highly appreciate it so if you could quickly drop a like right now uh but one more thing before we get to the video i am doing a modded account giveaway at the moment if you do want to enter all you got to do is subscribe to my youtube channel and comment the word giveaway in the comments below and you will be entered straight into that i'm announcing the giveaway winner on january 1st but i don't want to waste too much of your time and i think we can get straight to the video so the first thing what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to go outside your apartment and just take like a personal vehicle and by the way this video right here make sure you don't actually skip any parts of the video because i see some people commenting about some things that i've said in the video and that you have to do and they just ended up skipping it so uh, at least like watch until the outro so yeah, just make sure you don't skip any parts of the videos i know some youtubers they just talk a lot about nonsense but me i really do try to keep it and like straight to the point so right now we're going straight to the uh, spot where you have to start the glitch so yeah once you made your way to a clothing store so any clothing store on the map what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to equip the outfit that you want to transfer the cob belt on by the way no this is not a transfer glitch so you won't be losing any of your current outfits doing this and you don't need two consoles or neck cut like you don't need none of that so no transfer no neck cut so i chose this one right here with the white joggers so this is going to be the outfit that I wanted to choose to put the on. By the way, if you're wondering how I got the white joggers, I made a video about two days ago. Uh, you can go watch that if you want. I did a tutorial on how you can get the real white joggers. So this is how I got them here. Because I know some people will probably be asking me how I got them. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to make your way at the top. So you're going to have to make your way to utility vest. And you're going to have to equip uh, utility vest number 43. So it's going to be the peach blade carrier. It's going to be this one right here, number 43. Now, once you've equipped it, you're going to have to save it into any of your slots. So it really doesn't matter what slot you save it in. I said, I recommend that you save it in slot number one, just because it will be easier later on when we transfer the belt over, because you'll know it's in slot one. But if you can remember the name of the outfit that, we're, that you're saving, I guess it's fine. You could just save it in any slot. Uh, just easier if you save it in slot one. So now just go up to the counter and you've already saved the outfit. So what you're going to have to do is once you made your way up to the counter, you're going to have to make your way uh right here so down here to heist coveralls and you're gonna have to equip a heist coverall or a gas mask so it does cost forty five thousand dollars but it is worth it because most glitches in gta so most like clothing glitches you do actually need the heist coveralls with the gas mask so i highly do recommend you buy it i guess you don't have to because well then you won't be able to do the glitch if you don't have it um but it's a pretty good investment since you will be able to actually do a lot of clothing glitches so let me let me speed this part up because what you're gonna have to do is make your way to a telescope so it could be one on the pier or it could be one in your apartment i'm gonna be doing the one in the pier so you don't have to do the one i did so you could literally just go inside your apartment and do it there now once you made your way to the clothing store i mean not the clothing store the telescope what you're gonna have to do is run by the telescope and spam right on the d-pad Make sure your character didn't look into the telescope. If it did, you have to redo it. And now to equip the outfit that we have just saved, and you will see that the gas mask will transfer over to this outfit right here. And uh, yeah, you could take multiple tries right here. So just run by the telescope, make sure your character is not looking in the direction of the telescope, and then it should stop. So make sure that you spam around the pad, and then you equip the outfit that we've saved. So pretty simple. Uh, by the way, feel free to comment down below if you do have any questions. I will be responding to every single comment. So if you do have any questions about the glitch, just say like, uh, yo, I didn't understand this part right here at, I don't know, 403. How do you do the telescope glitch? So you can, you can just ask that. I'll literally like try to reply to your comment as fast as possible. And yeah, so the next thing what you're going to have to do is make your way right here by the mask store to actually save the outfit. Now, if you're doing this in your apartment, you could just go to your wardrobe and just save the outfit. But because I am doing it right here by the pier, I just went over to the mask store and save it. Now what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to start this job right here. So make sure you go to Rockstar Created, go to Missions, and start this mission right here called the Titan of a Job. Now for this part right here, you won't actually need anyone to start it up with. So you will start it up on your own. So I will show you to start it up. By the way, you might not see a Titan of a Job on your thing. So it could be one or two reasons. One, your account is not connected to Social Club. Or two, you're not level 12. So you have to be above level 12. Uh, but I guess you could start up a different mission that is also solo. So you can go to Missions and you can start a different one. 
Um, it could work as well. I haven't tried it out. I just always do it with Titan of a job because it's very easy. You don't actually have to do the mission. So now once you do load into the mission, you will notice that your alpha doesn't have the peach plate carrier anymore. So if it doesn't have the peach plate carrier anymore, it means you did the glitch, right? If it does, if it does still have the peach plate carrier, that means you did it wrong and you're going to have to restart it. So now what you're going to have to do is get inside a car. Uh, you might not get your personal vehicle, but that doesn't really matter because what you're going to have to do is make your way to any gas station, not gas station. I mean, uh, pistol shop or whatever it's called ammunition and you're gonna have to save your outfit just like this so you go over right here and save the outfit so as you can see i'm gonna be saving it in this slot right here so it doesn't really matter which slot you save it in there we go just like this now back out of the mission now once you have backed out of the mission just load back you will load back into online so preferably start up a friends or invite only session that way nobody bothers you while you're doing this now keep watching because we're not done yet. There's a few more things that we have to do. As you can see, we did load in here into online. Uh, okay, I did, I did just get it run over by a car. But you just go back into ammunition. Make sure you have your thing set to last location. Uh, it doesn't really matter. It's just a lot simpler. And now what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to equip an outfit with a belt. Now you don't actually need to have an outfit with a belt. So if you already have an outfit with the cop belt, you can just equip that. But if you don't have an outfit with the cop, a cop belt, what you're going to have to do is make your way to Casino Heist and just equip any of the prison guards. So the prison guards have some belts. As you can see right here, these, uh, like the little janitor belt right here, you need to unlock these, but these are actually really easy to unlock. You don't actually have to do any glitches. Uh, so I know some people at this part be like, wait, what, you, you need to unlock them? It's literally super simple. It took me five minutes to unlock it. All you gotta do, like for the prison one, for example, all you gotta do is do the prison preparation for the casino heist. It takes like literally five minutes. Now you're gonna have to bookmark this job in the description down below called It's a G Thing. So just go to the description and bookmark this job. And to actually for it to appear in your thing, make sure you put uh, outfits to player saved outfits. So clothing, player saved outfits, very important. And what you're gonna have to do is switch from the outfit you're currently on onto the outfit that you wanted to transfer the belt on. By the way, like I was saying, you have to restart your game for the belt or for, for the um, job to actually show up on your game. So make sure you bookmark it. And after you bookmark it, just restart your game. Now, once you have loaded in, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to open your phone and back out of the mission. And once you have backed out of the mission, you're gonna have to load back into online. And now what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna find a random street car. So uh, don't change your outfit yet. So just find like some random street car. There's one right here. You're gonna have to go inside the street car. You're gonna have to register to see yo. So now register as a CEO, just like this. And go to management styles and go once to the right and then once to the left, just like this. Multiple times. And then once you do get out, you will see that the belt will actually have merged onto the outfit. Uh, you will notice that the interaction menu looks a bit different because this was recorded before they changed the interaction menu. Uh, but I have tried it out because I made a video on the cop belt and it does still work. This method still works. I know some people will be saying, oh, you have the old interaction menu. It must not work. But no, it literally still works. And if this method did work for you, make sure you comment it down below so other people trying this out also do know that it works and just let them know that it does work because uh, it does work after the latest patch of 1.68. Um, but yeah, I'm not going to waste too much of your time. Uh, here's some videos on the screen if you want to watch them. And yeah, drop a like on this video and I'm going to catch you in my next video. Peace.